Gemini to Coinbase. I'm going to show you how you can move your Bitcoin, your Ethereum, or any of those assets that's on Gemini over to Coinbase. Let's say you want to move your assets over to Coinbase. I'm going to show you that very simple and very easy. So pay attention until this entire video because I'm going to make it look really easy for you. My name is Adam Shelton and thank you for watching this video today. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel because this is the place to be to grow your brand and grow your bank account. You know what time it is. Let's go ahead and dive in. Now, when you click on the link below and get access to the Gemini account and also to Coinbase, I have it in the description to go ahead and log in and get started with that. Come to the Gemini page just like this. It starts out like this. Come over to the right side if you're using your desktop, laptop, or tablet. Click on transfer. We want to go ahead and withdraw this and move this over to a different exchange. Let's find the right one we want to do it. Let's look for Bitcoin, Ethereum, any of those right here. Looks, let's take a look at Bitcoin, okay? The next thing is to do is that we got to go over to the exchange that we're trying to get the information from as well. So we got to go over to Coinbase. So make sure you have a Coinbase account. Click on the link below and you must have account to be able to connect all this together. I'm going to go to my portfolio and go right to Bitcoin. Go to Bitcoin. Now, the next thing I want to go ahead and do is click on send and receive because we're trying to receive the information. So we need we need to receive the address from a Bitcoin wallet in our exchange. So click on receive and this is where it goes. Make sure this is changed over to Bitcoin. I made this mistake before of not necessarily making sure the correct asset is selected. Make sure the right asset is selected. There's Bitcoin right there. Copy that. And then all I do is go back to Gemini. It says transfer to. It wants it needs an address to send it to. Just copy that just like that. Click on continue. I'll click on maximal. I'll send that over there. So the maximum amount of Bitcoin I can send over to Gemini is this amount here. Plus continue and voila. All I have to do is click on request withdraw and it's sent over. That's it. That is all. Because check it out. It says this is the address that's going to go to that 35S1 and the other numbers. <laughs> that's exactly what this is. 35S1 and the other numbers is going to receive this. So it matches up. All I got to do is click on request withdraw and also says this. Please ensure the accuracy of the address since Bitcoin transfer are irre irreversible. So make sure it's correct. I even do this, do even a notepad to make sure it's, it's correctly. So I even do like a little notepad. So see the notepad, make sure it matches and it matches that. Okay, that's matches. Da, 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 da. So I make sure that matches to make sure because it just says this irreversible. So you want to make sure this is correct. And all I do is cl click on request for draw, and that is it. Now, throughout this process, you can edit things. You can edit the amount. So let's say if I just want to do that amount, I can do that amount. You see how that just changed a little bit? I can change the address. It's, let's say I put the wrong address on here. I can go back and change that. Continue. Let's say I want to change the, the asset altogether. I can go ahead and do that right here. If I want to do Ethereum, it's going to change all of this on here. It's not going to, it's not going to match now. You want to make sure your stuff is matching in terms of the address and everything like that. So you can change that. Let's continue there. Now, when it does that, when you switch over, you do have to get the address back again, and then you're good to go like so. Continue, and then that's all that is. You see this? That's a Gemini logo. And this is the exchange where it's going to and that's it and usually take up to five, 30 minutes for it to get over there and then check your coinbase to make sure it's there as well that's what coinbase looks like right there my name is adam shelton and thank you for watching this video i just want to do a quick tutorial of going from gemini to coinbase absolutely you can do that very simple and really easy just make sure that if you're sending anything from gemini that accepts Coinbase. So right now, Gemini has Dogecoin. You don't want to move your Dogecoin to Coinbase because Coinbase, not right now, accepts it. They will eventually, but you don't want to move something over to somewhere else that don't match. So make sure they match. Find the matches like I showed you before. Here's the homepage. 
or the price you can click on prices and you can match so ethereum matches does it match uh does it match yeah ethereum so just go by and make sure they match and a lot of them do match a lot of them that's on gemini's is on coinbase so all right i'll see you in the next video click on the links below in the description box for your coinbase account and your gemini account you can go ahead and get started today start investing today and i'll see you on the next video don't forget to like comment subscribe i'm adam shelton i can't wait to see you on the next video